everyone my name is Ifo Alabi and welcome to another video so this video I'm going to try a recipe I saw for chocolate cake with mayonnaise so stick with me whilst we do this to do this chocolate cake there are actually like three layers there's the dry ingredients there's the butter one and then there's the one with hot water why hot water I don't know why it does something to it I guess so we're going to start with the dry ingredients three quarter flour half cup of cocoa powder three quarter teaspoons of baking soda quarter teaspoon of bacon powder half teaspoon of sea salt and then we're going to set the dry ingredients aside and then we are going to do the hot water mixture we're going to do three quarter cups of hot water quarter tablespoon of espresso powder and for those of you who are concerned that the espresso powder is going to like alter the taste of the chocolate fear not the espresso actually enhances the chocolate. Another half tablespoon of vanilla extract. So this also gets moved to the side. For the third part of the chocolate cake, this is a half cup of butter in which you add three quarter cup of sugar. We are going to cream the mixture. Always remember to scrape down the sides. After a couple of minutes of creaming the butter and sugar, this is how it looks like. So what I'll say to this is that thank God for technology. I remember when I was little, my mom, anytime my mom had an order, we had to cream the butter and sugar with our hands. Look, it's very stressful. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. So to this, we add the mayonnaise. So that's a quarter cup of mayonnaise. Let's add the other two components to this third component and then mix it. So this is a finished cake mix, chocolate, more chocolate. I'm back with a chocolate cake. This chocolate cake baked for almost an hour and I had to make it cool down considerably before I cut into it because if it was so hot and I cut into it, it would have just crumbled. That's my advice to you. If it's so hot, do not cut into it. Do not even take it out of the tin. The grand unveiling. Here's the chocolate cake going to cut a slice and see if we can actually taste the mayonnaise or not look at this chocolate cake oh it looks and smells heavenly you do not taste that mayonnaise in it at all and this chocolate cake is very soft it's very moist it's very spongy so if you're a fan of really spongy cake, this is for you. If you like moist cake, this is for you. If you're one of those people that you don't like your cake that moist or that fudgy or that spongy, please stay far away from this recipe. But all in all, I'm really excited about how this worked out. The only thing left is for my mom to taste it and see whether or not she likes it as compared to hers because, as I said, her chocolate cake is one of the best I've eaten. I'm down with this chocolate cake recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video. My name is Ifa Labi and I'll see you on my next video.